YouTube, what's good? We're back in this thing. Today we're going to be going over my 10k subscriber editing contest that I had with Keaton Jones. I'm in the Discord call with him and we'll talk to him real quick in a second. But I just want to say thank you for everyone entering. I think we had over 60 something entries, which is actually crazy because it's like editing a minute 30 music video just for a contest or whatever is insane. Appreciate everyone that entered. Uh, we had a bunch of really good submissions, and uh, it was a hard pick in the top three, but Keaton and I chose the ones that we saw with the best overall project and just had a consistent theme. I just wanted to give a quick second to our sponsors of this video, BrianDelmada.com. BrianDelmada.com is your primary source for high quality paper and tape textures. Do you ever find yourself wondering how all these elite directors are getting these paper effects and transitions? Well, BrianDelmada.com has your answers. Not only does the Ultimate Texture Bundle have over 210 4K drag and drop assets, also has a step-by-step -step tutorial playlist to help you achieve these paper effects used by directors like Lone Wolf and people from AUG. BrianDelmada.com is not responsible for a client wanting to pay more than normal wage due to insane paper effects. Please use BrianDelmada.com responsibly. All right, so I'm here with Keaton in Discord. Uh, appreciate you letting everyone use the footage, man. Yeah, yeah, Everyone, um, I watched as many as I could. <laughs> everyone yeah. that uh, used the footage, thank you again. It's, it's crazy seeing like my vision come to another vision's life and stuff. So I was really appreciative of everyone that entered in the contest. Y'all, y'all made my heart happy. Yeah, bro. There's so many talented people for real. Like we did really have a hard time picking the top three and it took a while. Like I watched all of them on stream or like, yeah, like a week ago or something. And I think it took like two and a half, three hours to get through all of them. And like, we just had like a bunch of people chilling in the Twitch chat. I think like over 80 people were like, live in the chat, just like rating each one and stuff. So it's definitely a really cool experience for the community we'll have a list of honorable mentions in the description all right so at third place we got justice june One thing I really noticed about the edit itself is just the 3D and the transitions. I personally loved all the sound effects. Yeah. Um, when I was watching, I was like, yeah, he actually took his time and added sound effects into the video. And also another thing that he did was change a lot of, like, he broke a lot of rules and just changing the effects in general. He was just making everything just off the charts. Yeah. <laughs> just like crazy yeah. to watch. In general, I, I, I love that. And then I love the color grading. No, for sure. Yeah. Uh, I think we were just kind of looking for people that, like took the extra mile and added the sound effects transitions color grading just stuff that like made it feel like a whole complete project and i think he really did a good job here for second place we got sarah's shots um this is one of my personal favorites <laughs> Tapping with my mind like what he know, he know, he know. Uh, uh. Tapping with my mind like what he know. Ballin' I hit the casino. Double dipping the tea like Totitos. That boy fake, he cheese like Doritos. You want beef, you can stick like it's Geno's. Counting on hundreds to twenties, you keep those. Ballin' like a free throw, but I am not d row Let's go to one, zero, zero, zero. You can't flex on me, bro. Little Charlie, call me a hero, but I do not say ho. I'm trapping up the safe house. The whole gang out. I'm racking out that bag now.
this. Uh, just in general, I like all the animations that were added. I like all the, the warp transitions and the screen transition to the next scene. Mm -hmm. uh, just in general, all the transitions were smooth and clean. There was nothing that I was like, that's like sloppy to watch. Everything was like kind of on point. So Sarah Shots, congrats on being second place winner. Yeah, definitely. I, I think the drawing effects that she did in there were like super fire and like took a lot of time. There's a lot of high energy and uh, there's some decent sound effects too. So congrats, Sarah. I think you killed this one. And then coming in at the first position, we got Pavel FX. Shout out to him. I could just tell how much time he spent on this project. The fire composition, the intro, sound effects, just everything about this felt like a legitimate music video. I almost would have said that he was the one that shot it. Like it almost felt like he made that connection with the footage so much that it just like seemed like a full project that he did it himself. Obviously, shout out Keaton for the footage. Did a crazy job shooting it, but that's how I felt about it. Yeah, bro. When I was watching this, um, literally... <laughs> For the first time like before like a week before the entry was sent i was like yo <laughs> yeah. like, he might i was like my mind was like he might have won that mug yeah but luckily uh we both had a mutual opinion about it but definitely uh one thing that he did that probably stood out most to probably me and you was the composition with the fire Bro. um and not only that, the way he changed the weather in the background was something I noticed. The way he kind of just made the shot seem like, again, like how he shot it. And like, he literally shot this for Matt and then just edited it and was like, yo, this is the yeah. video, bro. Like, it just felt like that whole connection with that whole entire video. So definitely congrats, bro. Like, I have no words. I was... I was like blown away when I watched it. Yeah, so, no, it, yeah. it's definitely really hard. I, I think it was a, I think he was a clear number one. Like I said, it was definitely hard to choose between the second and third and all the honorable mentions and stuff, but just his overall project just felt more complete and somehow i don't know I, I i guess let us know in the comments how long you spent on that project because i would have guessed he probably started the first day and submitted it i think like a few days before so uh congrats on number one man really appreciate everyone entering shout out keen shout out matt um where can they find you on social media and all that stuff yeah it's uh search me up at, at keaton d jones uh at keaton d jones and my video company is called dorm room entertainment so thank you guys definitely yeah i'll have them both linked below as well as matt stuff uh the top three positions and a uh, list of honorable mentions that keaton and i thought really deserved just to be looked at and also just go through the hashtag brian delbada editing contest and just watch some of them because there's a lot of really talented people even the people that aren't going to be in the honorable mentions are still very talented so again thank you guys so much for entering the contest that's pretty much all i got for this video 